Hello everybody, it's me. Welcome back to the video. Now, in this video, I'm going to be making a very big announcement. I am going to be hosting two tournaments uh, very, very soon. I'm going to be hosting a Lumion Legacy tournament, and I'm, then I'm going to be hosting a Doodle World tournament. Timestamps will be in the description that will tell you where to go if you want to learn know about the Lumi Legacy Tournament or if you want to know about the Doodle World Tournament. Either way, both of them are going to be very, very fun. And I hope you, hope you guys enjoy. And I actually plan on doing starting to do weekly special tournaments. Um, so yeah, I'm going to have a Discord server in the description down below which will have details to both of the tournaments and what will be what's going to be happening. And yeah. And if you guys want me to do more tournaments and have suggestions for what I could do in the future, let me know. I'm taking both Doodle World and Lumine Legacy. And with all that being said, let's get right into it. So starting off with the Lumine Legacy tournament. I'm not going to be having battle footage in the background because I need people to like be paying attention to how this is going to work. How the Lumine Legacy tournament is going to work. If you have ever played Pokemon VGC, I kind of got inspired to want to play it. Now, the Lumi Legacy Tournament I'm going to be hosting is going to have a, a first place prize of a Gamma Malvari with probably some other stuff added in there. But we'll see what happens with the prize pool. And what the tournament is going to be is if you've ever played VGC, then you know what, what I'm, where I'm going with this. But if you don't, I'll give you a little brief rundown. So, in VGC, you have a team of six Pokemon, and in battles, you bring four of them. So it's kind of like where in Lumion you have a team of, of seven Lumions and you bring five of them into battle, right? That is, that can give you a gist of how it's going to work. You might be asking, how is this going to work? So how the Lumion one will function, will function is you are going to ha play double battles, right? And in the double battle, you are going to uh, have your seven Lumions, but you're only going to bring four of them. And then, before the battle starts, you're going to send your team to the opponent. Not like all the equips and stuff, not all of that stuff. You're just going to send your team and ask, what Lumion do you want to ban? Because it's not six Pokemon, right? You can ban one Lumion on your opponent's team. And <clears throat> I will have, in the description below as before, a Discord server explaining what all is going to be going down. And... Um, and if people need to ask me questions, I'm up open to answering them. And the tournament is actually not going to be that big. Because it's a newer style and it might not work out all that well. So I'm only going to be doing it with 64 people. Yes, it's going to be a 64 person tournament. And how I'm going to do it is I'm going to explain when signups are going to open, the exact time, and the moment it turns that time, if I remember to... I should, I'm going to post a Discord server link, and the first 64 people in it, um, you are in, and you are in the tournament. If anyone else joins past the 64th person, I'm sorry, you will be kicked out. And that's pretty much how the Lumi Legacy one's going to work out. So a rundown of it. You have seven Lumians, send it to your, send it to your opponent that you're going to be fighting, ban one, and both of you ban one Lumian on your team. Um... Go into the battle with six Lumians, because one of them is banned. You bring four of those Lumians, not five. Four of them. And then, you battle it out, and it'll be a best of three. And, yes, the bands can change. Actually, I don't think... Did, should the bands change? I'll figure that out. Um, but, yeah. Hopefully, you guys enjoy that one. And we can go hop straight into the Doodle World section now. And let's get to it. And hello everyone here for the Doodle World Tournament. Now this tournament is going to be a very, very simple one to start off my like Doodle World and like tournament stuff in general, my reemergence of them. Now I would want to make every tournament that I do somewhat unique, but eventually, yes, I'm going to run out of stuff. So I probably will end up doing like reruns of old ones that people like. The first one I'm going to be hosting on Doodle World is actually going to be... A monotype tournament which if you do not know what a monotype is it is essentially a single type so let's say this um, if I was in a monotype tournament and I pulled grass type it doesn't mean that I can only use grass type right it, it, like I can't just use it mean doesn't mean I can only use like superior 
uh, other mono grass types. Like, I can't just only use those. I can also use stuff with dual of those typings, like Verizion I could use because that's a grass and fighting type, if I remember correctly, pretty sure it is. And then I could use the Superior because it's also a grass type. As long as all of your types have one singular um, common ground, then their team will be viable. And this one is going to be a bit bigger. I'm pretty sure we were going to go for 128 or 256, depending on how many people sign up. And we're actually going to be using Start GG, which is something that I haven't used before. So we're going to figure that out. And signups should start for the Doodle World one on the 30th of December, and they end on the, on New Year's Day. So New Year's Eve to New Year's Day is whenever you are going to be able to sign up. And listen, I get it's on a holiday, but it's not that hard to click a link and click sign up. It, it's not that hard. I'm just saying. But yeah, um, the tournament prizes for this one, there's going to be uh, top eight tournament prizes. Because Doodle World prizes are a bit easier to get than the Legacy ones. Top eight are going to get a recolor. So if you get into the top eight of the tournament, you will get one of my recolors. I might even make them six star PVPs if you want. And then the top four are going to get a misprint hidden trait six star. And then the first place, get this, is going to be getting an exclusive springling that is actually going to be given to me as a first place prize. I don't have it on me. <clears throat> I was trying to wait to make this video until I got the springling. But how this, what the first place prize is going to be is a, a two tint <clears throat> misprint hidden trait six star springling and the tint is going to be black and orange and i know someone that's watching this is going to be like oh my god i need that i went for black and orange because i feel like it's just like the general color scheme on sling a little, little springling here so i was like okay i'll go for that like orange and red could also work but orange black right like i think that one that color works and yeah this will be a pretty simple tournament um, and there's just going to be a total of eight recolors given away because the first place Springling will also have my recolor on it. So yeah, you get a double positive there, uh, like a super, uh, exclusive Springling and a recolor skin. So, Hey, yeah, you, you get both of those things, but yeah, honestly, I'm really excited to get back into it. And if you want if anyone has any ideas for Doodle World tournaments that I can host, then let me know because I am totally up for doing them. And I might be hosting the tournament, but I'm not exactly going exactly going to be managing it. My friend Sling is mostly going to be the one managing the tournament, and he's also going to be entering it from what I know of, but in the end, all the shots will come down to me, so no worries. We're hopefully not going to have any cheating scandals. Reminds me of a story that happened one time. But anyhow, hopefully you all enjoy and you guys are excited for these tournaments because I really want to get back into doing them, but yeah. With all that being said, hopefully you guys enjoy and get ready because if you go, you gotta get ready to go to the link in the description, the Discord server link in the description below so you can join the Discord server where it will all be happening. All right? But yeah, with all that being said, hopefully you enjoy and I'll see everyone later. Bye bye.